Last week in Le Bourg was a tough test. Uh, what did you learn from that? Well, the most important thing is his determination. Um, on paper, we for sure had a uh, had a good team. It also started off well, but the Irish taught us a lesson. They were they didn't even bring their best horses, but they were determined from fence number one till the last fence they jumped to win the thing, which they did, and that was a really good lesson for all of us again. How tough do you think the course was? It turned out to be, when we walked it, we thought it was a nice course, first round, okay, and then it turned out to be that the second round was really hard, and I still do not exactly know why, but it was really difficult to jump, and there were many faults, also many, you know, uh, that you say, well, good rider-horse combinations had 12 and 16 and stop, and here and that, that was um, uh, astonishing to all of us, actually. Was it clever bit of course designing by um, Frederick? I would think in the end it was uh, much more clever than we thought uh, to start off with. Do you think we could see him building some big championship courses in the future? I don't know. Perhaps that is in the planning, you know, to try to uh, to point him direction, Khan, in uh, in three years for the World Championships. But okay, there's a lot has to be seen. Perhaps he has to go out more. He doesn't build enough at that level. Perhaps he has to expose himself more uh, at different international shows. Well, we're here in Rome now. Um, what's your team? The team is exactly the same as what we had in La Bolle. It's just that three riders will ride three different horses and only Michel will ride the same mare. What's this event like? Uh, you know, it's now on sand, it used to be on grass. What, what, do, you, what do you and the riders feel this event's like? <laughs> uh, for sure, you know, the surroundings, it's absolutely amazing. It's beautiful. With the grass, it was even more beautiful. It was astonishing then. Uh, but the grass, because they have to use this for many events during the year, so they could not really keep it up to the level that we wanted to. And if we had rain, sometimes we ended up with, with bad uh, conditions. Now, with the, the very good sand, we are all under from the horse number one till the last horse. We're under the same conditions. And already it proved itself for the last couple of years that the, the footing is really good. And the weather, it's, it's hot, sunny. Will that play a part with the horses? Uh, it might be play a part in the second round again, yes. But uh, let's be grateful that it's this kind of weather this time of year. Brilliant. Thank you for your time and uh, good luck with Team France tomorrow. Thank you.